but 740 is my final offer. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, thank you very much. Bye. Hi, my name's Glenn Armstrong, and uh, I'm, well, I suppose it's called a property multimillionaire. I've been doing property since 2004, and I've been very fortunate in making some very good decisions along the way. And I'd like to share with you, at request, a day in my life. So this is a day in the life of Glenn Armstrong, property multimillionaire. So I spend a lot of my days when I'm not out and about looking at properties working from this spot. As you can see, it's uh, not too terrible a spot. Today I'll be dealing with emails, I'll be dealing with my training business, uh, my mentees, my students, 77 clients and now millionaires, many financially free, hundreds in fact are financially free. Um, I like the fact I can see out of the um, back and out of the front. Um, now, the kitchen, that's my speciality when designing properties, property layouts and everything. I've pretty much used this kitchen as an example for what we tend to do. So I have the bifold doors, which is a feature that we always try and put into, especially the more uh, expensive properties. Uh, and on a nice day like today, you can't beat the bifold doors to have them open. And I have a white wine fridge, I have a red wine fridge, my own unique beer fridge. The stove here with the extractor, two nice size, double size fridges. I have hot plates, three ovens, and there's another hot plate there, and the freezer. Uh, this particular part, one of the things I love and use the most is my instant boiling water tap. And uh, probably about three and a half grand. Another fridge here, and a nice TV. Often in the evenings I'll have some friends over, a couple glasses of wine, and get the music on and have a, a nice game of pool. Uh, I love this table, it just flips over so you can use it as a dining room table, office table, meeting table, and there we go. little break it's a nice warm sunny day so I'm just gonna have a small beer uh, and chill out for 15 minutes before I get back on with my emails and my phone calls to my clients and talking up and following up on my property deals cheers so one of the things I love about where I live is um, that is really great for, for dinner parties and barbecues of which I have quite a few um, so you can see the space is absolutely perfect the kitchen opens out onto the patio um, the kitchen's got one of the bits and pieces you need in there uh, you've got the barbecue area that's two-sided there's another smaller barbecue the other side and you've got all the tables and chairs you can see uh, all around so let me uh, wander up and introduce you to my pond where I like to spend quite a lot of my time. One of my favourite places to relax is my pond. Uh, I quite often come and just sit up here for half an hour, watch the more hens, watch the ducks. Uh, there are literally thousands of little tiny fish in there. It's actually quite amazing. I don't know if um, you personally believe in the law of attraction, but I certainly do. Um, well before I bought this property I had um, pictures on a vision board of a house that looked similar to this uh, driveway that looked similar to the driveway of this house also with the, the fountain in the middle um, but the most remarkable thing is I also had an illuminated uh, one of these pagodas which is very strange um, because it's almost identical shape identical one to the one I had on my vision board 
Um, now I don't necessarily call it um, that. I actually call this one Bloat Pod because uh, uh, between you and me, I like to sit here and uh, look at my property and gloat a little bit. I have um, some larger pop uh, fish in here as well, and uh, over the next few months, um, I've got a couple of uh, deals cashing out, a couple of uh, things that have been wrong in the actual more cash. I'm going to build a pond near the house with a four foot glass front, two or three foot into the ground, so that from the kitchen I'll be able to see the fish from around. But these are some of the fish that I have now. Stray koi, uh, just very small ones, some goldfish, but mainly I bought a um, hundred uh, common carp ready to go in the pond.